What's up everybody, welcome to another video here at Leave the Bubble where we talk about expanding our comfort zones, dealing with changes and embracing challenges in life. My name is Phil and today I'm coming to you from beautiful Andalusia. Now, seeing that I'm traveling with my family and doing lots of different things, I thought that today we should talk about one of my favorite flavors of life, curiosity. Now, curiosity can be manifested in different things. It can be a scientific research, it can lead to novel professional opportunities, but it can also lead to a better relationship with your friends, with your partner, or with your family members. Curiosity is a beautiful thing that can also lead to adventures and excitement, and to put it simply, curiosity enriches our lives. Now, why exactly is curiosity important? Well, first of all, curiosity makes you a lot more observant and it helps you recognize new ideas, new topics and interesting facts of life. When you're more observant, then your brain starts becoming more active. And once our brain is more active, then we start seeing the potential in all the little aspects in life. And at the same time, once we start seeing the potential in all these little details, we break free from the mold of boredom and start seeing excitement in our lives. We start seeing something more intriguing, something that's novel, something that's new and something that enriches our day-to-day, -day, which ultimately leads to a more fulfilling, more satisfying, and a happier life in general. So now that we know that curiosity is important, how exactly do we improve our desire, improve that ability of curiosity? Well, one of the first things that we can do is being an open-minded person. Now, I've done a video on this over here, so I won't be getting too much into it, but it definitely helps us to see things in a different perspective, to unlearn bad habits and to learn good ones at the same time. Leave your preconceptions behind and start seeing everything with a new mindset because once you have an open mind, once you have a new perspective, I'm sure that this will enrich your life and you will see things from a brand new angle. Now, the next thing we can do when it comes to being more curious is asking questions. One of my favorite things to do when it comes to learning new things is ask clarifying questions, ask deeper questions. Why is this this and why is that that way? It's always good to ask questions, be curious in that literal sense and dive deep into the things that interest you for sure. And lastly, expand your worldviews. If you can, read a book from an author that has interesting insights or different thoughts than you. Watch a documentary movie on something that interests you or listen to someone that has a lot more life experience than you. Talk to your grandparents, talk to someone's uncle. It doesn't really matter. Soaking up different points of views and enjoying that process is a surefire way to willingly and joyfully improve your inquisitiveness and general interests. Now, curiosity can be applicable in all facets of life, but one of the most important things and definitely one of the things that I wanna leave you with here is employing curiosity in our social and personal relationships. Now, showing a sincere interest in someone else's life is a fantastic way to show that we care. Ask questions, what have they been up to? What are their future projects? Uh, how have they been? Are they happy? Are they well? Are they sick? Uh, it doesn't really matter. As long as you show a sincere interest, you ask questions and then you react accordingly. So with the information that you get, you show some empathy, you show support, you show that you are happy for them, you help them celebrate, you help them grieve. Uh, it shows that we care and it definitely helps to improve our social relationships. So not only stay curious because it helps you personally, but because it can improve your relationships with others as well. Now, oftentimes when it comes to expanding our comfort zones or trying out something new, we are stopped by our fears or by our feelings of discomfort or anxiety. And actually, curiosity is the perfect counterweight for it. Because when we feel that burning desire, that thirst for knowledge and discovery, we can't help but to move forward and push through. I'm very confident that by reframing situations in a positive way, asking questions, recognizing new ideas and showing a sincere interest into other people's lives, we can grow little by little each day. So let's all try to be more curious in life. Enjoy the process of gaining that heightened sense of curiosity, exploring those new worlds and discovering unimaginable feelings, emotions and experiences. I wish you all the best during the journey. Keep enjoying the sun, keep enjoying the summer. And as always, don't be afraid to leave your bubble.